Hello Youtubers, I'm Paris and this is our 17th video in PyQt5 GUI development and our topic is on Qt Quick and QML. So in the previous video we have uh, cre talked about creating row and columns in Qt Quick. So this was from the previous video. Uh, in this video uh, I'm going to talk about another layout that is called a uh, grid. So grid layout or by using grid how you can uh, manage your elements. So, uh, I'm going to create a new QML file in here. So, right click, file, I call it uh, grid.qml. Okay, now the first thing I need, uh, I need to import. So, import uh, qt quick dot window 2.2. Also, I need to import Qt Quick 2.3 like this. Okay. Uh, also, I need to create a window. Uh, the visibility should be true, and the ID is root. Uh, we have the width uh, 360 and the height. Uh, 360 okay so in the window we need to uh, create a repeater so repeater and uh, I'm going to give the model for the repeater 16 uh, I want to create 16 repeated rectangles so now uh, I want to give it rectangle and uh, the color is red and uh, the width and height so the width is 360 divided by 4 and the height 360 divided by 4 so if you run this right now and let me just run it change the row to grid.gml let me run it I have problem in the grid so rectangle width height uh, ID visible so where is the problem color red, width and height so uh, the problem is in here yeah it's window let me run it okay now you can see we have uh, a 16 uh, rectangle but it's stacked uh, at, at the top of each other so now we need to use grid in here uh, in this section, I'm going to create a grid. So grid. Let me wrap my elements in a grid. Okay. So now uh, I want to give uh, columns. Columns of. Uh, for the column, I want to give it four. And for the rows, I want to give it four. So now let me just run it. Okay, uh, we have, but we need to give a spacing for our rectangles between our rectangles. So spacing, uh, I want to give it fifteen. Now let me run it again. So now you can see we have our rectangles in here. This is the grid. Thank you guys. I will add a source code to the video description. You can check uh, my blog, subscribe to the channel, like the video and share the video.